Hello everyone, welcome back again. This is Jesse, and then in today's tutorial concerning data cleaning in Python, we're working with two issues, right? Dropping duplicate and then dealing with different data data types. So, from the previous tutorial, this was what we were working with. Now, so from this value that we have, we are, can realize that some 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 kind of data will come with duplicates, right? It's having duplicates. So let's check that one. We make it ten so that you can see the duplicate I was talking about. You realize that you have two here, right? Avengers Age of Ultron, Avengers Age of Ultron, which is almost similar. So how do you deal with this duplicate? That is, this is a small set, so you can see it. But what if it's a big set, data set? You can just do this format of df, right? Dot duplicated, duplicated. Then it's going to list it for us perfectly. So we realize that it's given us as false, 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 false. But we all know, we also that we have duplicate so it can be more specific to help solve this issue so df dot duplicated duplicated then i'm going to pass in a column so movie title so when i check it it's going to tell us that false 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 and number eight is true so number eight is a duplicate so if i go back and i check for df dot head my 10 right you realize that we have number eight and seven as duplicate eight and seven were duplicate so now how do you deal with it how do you remove this duplicate from it you can drop it so to do that you just go with df let's call it df drop dupe and df dot drop and that's called duplicate right so first of all, let's check for our shape of our data first. So df dot shape. So that is sixteen. Now after dropping it, you see how much is left. So let's go back and see what we have. So just drop it. Then if I go back and I do shape, Ooh, see that it still give us this. 14. Why? Because it is not specific. So we should be more specific. So let's make it more specific by using move movie title. Right? If I do it like this and I check back again, you realize that that's removed is perfectly. So that is it's just using that movie title as the key to be able to remove it perfectly. So that's one way of removing duplicate from it. Okay, so now let's check some other things. You can also have with when clean data types. When clean data, that is having data type inconsistency. I hope it's correct. <laughs> anyway, I hope this is not inconsistent. <laughs> okay, so let's move on. So first of all, you can have to first change it. There are two ways you can change the data type before reading the file or after reading the file, right? So if you want to do it before reading the file, then you're going to do it in this format of passing it like this. So let me copy this one. So for example, let's say we have DF, then you pass it like this. So whilst you are reading the file, let's say this is our file. So file.csv. I don't have any file, but whilst you're reading the file, you can specify a column that you want to change it. So in that way, you want to read it straight away and then change it. That is one of the methods of using. Right? So the next one is you can also actually check for the data types and then after you have opened the file, check for the data types and then change it. So let's check for the data type to df dot d types. It's going to list all of this for us. We have object. Object is more like a string. Integer, float, object, and all those. So in case it's having a string and object, it's going to take it's having a string and then numbers or integers to just switch to the bigger one, right? Object. So now let's see how to check how to change one. So let's say I want to change this one, right? Goes from integer to float. I want to work with float so I can make it like df and then let's say gross dot d type it's an integer so I want to change it from this format into a float so how do you think I'll do that I'll just go with this df dot as type so that is how to do that so the as type takes the this is how to do the as type format, right? So this is the, the documentation on it. Now let's try that one. I'm going to have df. 
I should specific. I want to change this column to a different type. So I'm going to make it like cross dots as type as type. Then float so that has changed the entire stuff into a float. So if I check for this one again, the type it is now a float, right? So that is one of the ways of changing from one format to a different format. So thank you for watching. If you have any question or contribution, you can just put it inside the comment section so that everybody can benefit. Please don't forget to subscribe. Stay blessed.